Glenda, this man goes by the name Drifter Shoots. He sat at the top of the Ambassador Bridge and took pictures worth a million words. Well, now those pictures are raising concerns about security. First, how this man was able to make it past security and get all the way up there. My motto is to the moon and never back. His pictures are mesmerizing. Some will even make your stomach turn. But the pictures are meant as inspiration. I love my art and I try to keep it 100% pure and authentic. And I want people to know that it comes from a good place and from a good heart. The pictures are impeccable, but where is security? And how is this man able to make it to the top of the Ambassador Bridge and other buildings without being detected? Is it a cause for concern? I would say that the, the security is excellent, but no, I don't think that anybody has anything to worry about. I think that the security there is excellent. The Ambassador Bridge is owned by the International Bridge Company. They are responsible for security. We reached out for comment, but haven't heard back. His Instagram account is full of photos from high above the Earth's surface. This one in Chicago on top of the Vista Tower. This one over Times Square in New York. And this photo right here in Detroit, high atop the Penobscot building. Good art makes you feel something. My pictures might terrify some people. They might inspire other people. But as long as they mix up something inside people, I've done my job. Drifter Shoot says people shouldn't try or do the things he's done. Not a single person out there would I encourage to do what I've done. I want them to understand the idea and the concept behind it, but I do not want them to recreate the activity uh, themselves. And tonight, Drifter Shoots telling me he understands it's very dangerous climbing to the top of these bridges and skyscrapers, but says it's his art and says that he will continue to do it to try and inspire others through it. Reporting live tonight in Southwest Detroit, I'm Alan Campbell, 7 Action News.